Okay, we are getting back into Breath of the Wild. This is the second episode, and it has been a week or so since I last streamed or put a YouTube video up. So, without further ado, let's get started. Oh my gosh, we're back in the game. Oh, it's been too long. It has been too long. I've missed you. Oh, look at you. Time to fight. Nope. Get down. You're not allowed to get back up. Oh, hey, I don't have a spear yet. Cool. We got a spear! <gasps> That's so cool. I like poking things. <laughs> Let's go poke all the things. So last time we were getting all the shrines and uh, we only got two and we needed I think three total to get the uh, the glider. Uh, we only need three total to get the glider, so we're gonna go and I guess do the last shrine and get our glider. That looks like that looks like death. You know, like in Land Before Time when all the dinosaurs died in the the swamp thing. That that's what that lo that looks like. So I'm gonna say it's probably a safe bet that that will happen to me if I try to go in there. Uh, ooh. But I want to get those chests. Look at those chests, they look so pretty. Alright, let's, uh, see the shroom. And... we'll give it a go. I have a feeling I'm just gonna sink, though. Oh, uh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. That's that's what happened to the dinosaurs. Okay, well, perhaps I need a glider to get across here. I'm not entirely sure. It looks like I might be able to get up on like one of these tree things. Yeah, it it's likely that you get your glider and then you glide across. So, I'm going to have to defer that for later. So we need to find an orange shrine. What is that thing? It's dead now. Choo-choo jelly. Oh yeah, these used to be like, uh, super valuable. And other Zelda games. I wonder what you can do with them. doesn't see me. I shall sneak up on him. I got this. I got this. Surprise attack. Here we come. No! How did you see me? And possible. Puck, puck, puck. Yes. Where did my head go? Head? Where is you? Why you know display? Oh yeah. Uh it looks like I had turned it off. <laughs> Oops. Yay, I see things now. I can see clearly now. My HUD is back. I really like this spear. Did I just destroy that jelly? I think I destroyed that jelly. What the hell? That was weird. Oh, 
Oh, I just want to live in here. This is so cool. This is like the perfect little hideout area. You know, just put some some branches and leaves to cover the gaps and you got a little living space. Oh hey, it's the dude. What are you doing here? Well, 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 so we meet again. My back is aching. I clearly need to take a little break. Hey, courageous one, are you hungry? If so, please feel free to use my cooking pot to whip up a snack. If you need to start a fire, just light your torch on the campfire over there. Uh-huh. Uh, okay. If you play your cards right, you may even end up with a dish that can help protect you from extreme cold. Why would I need to do that? Are you trying to tell me something? It's all about being creative and trying different things. Oh ho ho. Yep. And... How do I light this thing? Oh, there you go. Cool. Uh, well... Let's hold this one, and that one, and cook it. <laughs> Look at them bounce. Uh, hasty elixir. Grants a low level haste effect which boosts your movement speed while running, swimming, or climbing. Ooh. Oh yeah, I forgot that I got these. Good. Yes. Thanks, old man, for letting me use your fire. And pot. <gasps> ah! No, come back. Come back. Damn. Should I shoot it? Oh, damn. My arrow, like, goes so flat. I need, like, a compound bow. That's what I need. Oh, shit. Oh, they're attacking the, uh, the boars. That's cool. Shield. Oh, don't, don't call for help. Don't do that. You, you don't need to do that. No one's here. Don't worry. <laughs> Yeah! Just time. Opal. Wow. Valuable ore that gives off mesmerizing iridescence. Similar to the inside of a seashell, it contains the power of water. Ooh, what's that? <gasps> ah! Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on! Don't attack me! I need a switch. There we go. Nope. Yes. Quit throwing rocks at me. Crazy. Crazy skeleton. How did you get- Did you get on your brother's head? Or body? What the hell? They can switch bodies. That's weird. What's that? Kuroko leaf. A single swing of this giant sturdy leaf can create a gust of wind strong enough to blow away light objects. This will sometimes fall off trees as they're chopped down. That's freaking cool! And wood? Look at that. Portable bundle of wood. I mean, isn't all wood portable? <laughs> Ooh. I'm so getting that honey. Don't attack me. Oh shit, oh shit, they're actually coming. Can I fight them? Oh cool. No, no, no. This isn't working. This isn't working. 
Uh. Okay, they ran off. Ah, oh, look at those. Look at those lightning bugs. I need to get switch weapons. Yes. Whoosh. Ooh, I can use it against the bees, maybe. Where that honey at? It was over here, right? Yeah. Horse or bee honey. Honey straight from the hive. It is chock full of nutrients. Cooking it into a mill unlocks the potential of these nu nutrients and provides a stamina recovery effect. Awesome. Oh, God. Go away, Apple. Key swing. I am so glad I got this leaf right now. A rare material dropped by a defeated keys. It's fun to look at, but it doesn't seem to have much use at first glance. But it might be good for something. Can never have too many things. Unless you can have too many things. Then that would suck. Oh my god! Run away! I don't want any more things! Leave me alone! No! How am I gonna fight you? I'm a lonely Hyrulean. Uh, what I got? What I got? I got a lot of nothing. Oh my god, it can throw rocks. How is this fair? It seems to have a thing on its back. Oh, shit. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, uh, Cecil, Cecil. Come on. Turn that back of yours. Ah, oh, that didn't do anything. Oh my god, it's getting so close. Uh, oh yeah, maybe I can use a bomb. Totally forgot I have bombs. Okay. Oh! Well... I died. Collect all the shrooms, and then run away! Ah, uh, shit, 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 shit. Why does everything one-shot me? It's not cool. Oh, lizard, lizard. They just disappear, that sucks. Where's my staff? Calling for help. Oh, how did you not die? Away with you. Damn, that spear didn't last long at all. Ah, wow, that was close. Damn, get on. Ooh, hey, look, a pathway. This seems like a pretty important place to go. Ooh. 
Ooh, pretty view. Wow. Is there a chest up here? See a butterfly? And I never got those lightning bugs. I should have got those. chest just a beat whoa what is that I see a, like a horse thing it's so cool looking <gasps> I found a chest I found a chest I found a chest aha Dang, I am rolling an opal. Yep. Ooh, there's a crack here. <laughs> if you uh, are familiar with how most... Okay. Okay, just just roll away. Just roll away, you know. I, I didn't need you at all. I mean, d don't mind me. I'll just, I'll just go do my own thing. Trying to say something. Anyways, if you're familiar with how Zelda works, usually a crack means secret. Cut me. There's no secret. But this one is a secret. Look at it. It's even like discolored looking. Let's do it. There's no secret. What is this? Am I going to be able to get up there? So, I try. This is quite the trek. You can do it. Okay, okay, okay. Let go. Let go. I did it. Uh, drop. No. I want to complete the square. <laughs> All right, let's try it from this side. Oh my gosh. Link, do you not know how to put a square on a square? Come on. Woo! Oh, hi. Ya ha ha, you found me. You're not Hetsu, but you can see me? I didn't know your kind could see children of the forest. Well, if you run into Hetsu, please return this to him. <gasps> my first quest! Oh my god. Kuroko Seed. This small seed was given to you by Crook. It has a distinct smell. If you gather a bunch of them, you never know what may happen. Oh, and my friends are hiding in lots of different places too. Don't be shy about poking your nose in suspicious places. 
I will do that. <laughs> Wee hee. Uh, okay. Now what? There's a tower right there. But I'm not sure I can get up there, can I? Maybe, oh, you know what? I could probably, I could probably make it up there from this section. I'm gonna give it a go. Time to climb. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I'm supposed to go this way, but I'm doing it. Yes! Look, there's a shrine! We did it! I see the shrine. Oh man, look how high up there it is. Dangerously low. Find warmth soon or you'll take damage. Ah, damn it, really? What if we get the torch, light it on fire, go where it's cold, and use the torch to keep us warm? Let us find out. Here. I wonder if I'm going to lose my torch. This seems to be working. There's also a campfire there, so let's get a note. Okay. If I get in that water, I'm gonna be pretty fucked. Uh, it looks like I can activate the thing. Oh shit. I think I'm taking damage. Yeah, I'm taking cold damage. Ah shit. Oh cool, you can do that. I wasn't so sure. Yay! Oh, there goes my claymore. Well, there goes my wood axe. Ah! Well, my spear is broke. I only had that for like two seconds. Wow, there's so many of them down there. Shoot. What am I gonna do? Time to club them. Oh my god, his spear's on fire. He's on fire. Oh my god! He just like one shot me. Let's cook all the. Are those strawberries? Peppers. Spicy pepper. Exploding with spice. Cook with it to create dishes that will raise your body temperature and help you withstand the cold. Oh! Okay, I see, I see. <laughs> Spicy sautéed peppers grants low-level cold resistance. The, s the spiciness of these sautéed peppers has been broken by heat, the heat for a sweeter taste. What if we hold two? Oh. oh, this one's five minutes. It takes so little damage. You 
you shall die. How dare you? Ah. why I can't have nice things. <gasps> Ooh, what is that? Spiked Boko shield. And a soldier's broadsword. What? Holy crap. That was so worth it. Give me that sword. <gasps> yes! Oh, look at that. Give me that spiked Boko shield. Oh, man. I'm so cool now. Look at me. My cool shield eats. All right, we got two minutes. Two minutes and thirty seconds. Need to make it through. Okay. Oh, there's another one right here. Got it. Good enough. Oof. All right, we made it across. I think we might actually be able to get to that shrine. Ah, it's been a really long adventure. been so much harder to get to the shrine than like the third shrine than I thought it would be. I mean maybe uh, there was another shrine closer by that I didn't notice but oh well I got a sweet sword I don't care. Oof. I must have done there. Look at you throwing snowballs, aren't you cute? Oh. Damn. Get freaking dead. Ooh. Hello. Seared steak. I will take that. Cold resistance about up. Alright, we need to get in there. Need to get in that shrine. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Uh. We can do it. Shrine time. Yes! Finally! Okay, okay. Don't, don't, don't freeze to death. Come on, go, go, go! Go, go, go! Sets foot in the shrine. I am Ka Nemet in the name of the goddess Hyel. I am something trial. Okay. Trial time. Is it fire? Give me fire. Sheikah Slate activated. Distilling rune. It's ice. Of course it's ice. 
Create a pillar of ice from a water surface. Build ice pillars that are very stable. These pillars can be used as stepping stones or as obstacles. Use cryonis on an ice pillar to break it. Okay. Uh, that's cool. Ash, do that. Oh, that is cool. I'm assuming I should do like this. Ah, oh, it was right. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Aha! You just thought you. Oh no! Okay, okay, okay! Stop! Oh, damn it. Aha! No, you don't! Ah! Alright, enough of this. I know what to do now. Dang it, come on. Freeze. Freeze. Ah, uh, you're so annoying. Alright, I'm just gonna shoot you with my bow. Let's eat that steak. That's one direction I can go. I can go both directions. Oh. What? Oh, there's a chest right there. Yeah, let's get that chest. Real quickly. Yes! Look at that! Oh. Why does that always happen? Uh, we don't need that many sticks. I will take it. Yes, complete the shrine. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of Goddess Hyle, I bestow upon you the spirit orb. Yes. May the goddess smile upon you. Bye bye, Buddha man. Oh shit, it's so cold. It's so cold. Eat it. Eat that, Papa. You know, this is kind of counterproductive or counterintuitive because peppers don't actually warm you up. They actually decrease your core body temperature. 
So, uh, just a slight oversight. That's all I'm saying. What is that? That's a chest. I want that chest. I think I can just create pillars all the way there. Because I'm assuming the water will kill me. Oh, cool. I think I have three at a time. Opal. Ah! No, 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 get out of the way. Get out of the way. Yeah, let's go to the old man dude. Oh, hi, old man. Hmm. What? The sun will set soon. So then, can I summarize that your shrine search is going well? Yes. Hmm. You've cleared three shrines now. Good work. However, there is still one more that eludes you. There is still one more. Uh, I thought it was three, old man. Help me out here. Must I keep repeating myself? You must really need to learn some self-reliance, -re my friend. Just check the pause screen if you ever need a reminder of what you can do. What the hell? Really? Temple of Time. Ooh. I want to go inside. Oh, you can pray. You have con- you who have conquered the shrines and claimed their spirit orbs, I can offer you great power. But you do not have four spirit orbs. Seek out the shrines scattered across Hyrule and face more challenges. Once you have claimed four spirit orbs, return to me. I can do that. There's a shrine right next door. I have pretty big concerns that those things are gonna like reanimate later. I'm so not ready for that. What's up here? I hope there's a chest over here somewhere. Probably should sneak just so I don't die. I think it's taking me to the top. Tip it up. Oh, <laughs> yes, I knew it. There was a chest. <gasps> yeah. Oh, I got a soldier bow. I'm so happy. Oh my god. I got my soldier bow. Got my soldier sword. I am so cool. <laughs> That's so cool. Okay, the shrine I need to get to is Daro. It looks like you can actually climb up from below. Oh, okay, that's pretty easy. So, wait. Yeah. Yeah, let's just go. Oh hey, it's the guy. 
what sage of ice do you got for me this time? Aha, <laughs> uh -huh, fancy that. So we meet again. What are you doing? I thought this tree here might make for some good firewood. Hmm. However, getting a tree to fall exactly where you want it to is quite an art. The trick is to turn your hips so that they face where you want the tree to land. Ooh. It's best to use an axe when felling trees. A sword works in a pinch, but you'll end up running the blade. I'm not doing that. Give me your axe. Give me your axe. Yeah, go sit down. Put your axe down. There's gotta be an axe over here. Ooh, mushroom. The old man's diary. Oh yeah, definitely read that. On this desolate plateau, the only pleasure that brings me comfort is cooking. And today I outdid myself. Truly, I created the perfect dish. I call it spicy meat and seafood fry. <laughs> this recipe not only restores health, but it also keeps me warm even when traveling in the snowy mountains. With this dish on my side, I no longer have need of that itchy warm doublet. What is a doublet? Okay. I do not know how I allowed this to happen, but it seems I forgot to write down a very important recipe. I know it's contained raw meat and spicy pepper. However, I simply cannot remember what else I use. My age is catching up to me. Sadly, on this lonely plateau, I have only my own knowledge and my memory to rely on. Still, if I did find someone who knew the missing ingredient, I would happily reward them with my warm doublet. However, it seems unlikely that such a miraculous wish will ever be fulfilled. <laughs> All right. Well, I shall get that warm doublet. Oh, next. Damn. This seems like a reoccurring theme where I just need to throw away shit. Uh, I, I can throw this away. Yes. Okay. <gasps> vase. Ooh, a spicy pepper. Another vase. No, I want to break it. Oh, okay, that works. Uh, oh! <gasps> what? I can light my arrow on fire? What is this madness? Oh, that's so cool. Pitchfork. Use the tool to hay efficiently. It's light enough to be used by anyone. The four prongs are very sharp. Uh, guess what? I got no space. No space. Drop! Ooh, yeah. More leaves. No, don't push it. Get on top. Jump up. There we go. Slow, slow. God. That was nerve wracking. Okay. Let's try out that spear. Dang. Killed so good that it knocked him off. Okay, so it looks like I start here. Yeah, I start here and then I go up. Oh. 
This might take a while. I don't know if I'm gonna make it if I'm already sweating. Can I grab shrooms while I'm climbing? Grab it! Grab it! Oh, I totally can. Okay. Next target. Do the right. Alright, I think I'm getting to the end. It's shrine time! There it is! Paraglider, here I come! So it seems like the theme is that you can always get a power, there's always a chest, and you always talk to an old dude man. Alright, what's this one all about? Ooh. To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am Oa Dayum. In the name of the goddess Hyale, I offer this trial. Something. Stasis trial. Ooh. Oh, I'm gonna be able to stop time and things. Stilling rune. Do 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 do. Stasis. Stop the flow of time for an object. Stops an object in time while storing its kinetic energy. The stored energy will act upon the object when the flow of time resumes. Making good use of the stored energy can remove even the largest of objects. That's cool. Oh, let's see what it does. Okay, stop turn. Uh, oh, I gotta. Yeah, that thing. Whoa, what in the world? Stop turn now. Yeah, did it. Did I see something flying by? Or is that just my imagination? Oh, that's, that's what it is. Okay. Uh... Here's... But I can stop it now. Uh... Definitely want that chest. Oh, shoot. I missed it. What? No, no, stop, stop. Yeah. And there's the chest. Traveler shield. Ooh. Damn it. That one's gonna be dropped. One of that one. And let's get it. I mean, I don't really use the shirt at the moment, but I think that one looks cool. Ooh. <gasps> Sledgehammer. Don't need that Boko Spear no more. Drop that. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Can I break a thing? What things can I break? Ah, uh, I need to break the bad thing. Ah. 
What did it say about moving objects? Hmm. I mean, the obvious thing to do is to use this big sledgehammer to hit that big boulder. But I want to stop time. Oh. And then hit it. Why? Oh. Well, that, that worked. Somehow. Because physics. Yuri, sourcefulness in overcoming the, this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you the spirit orb. Spirit orb, paraglider, all the things. Yes. May the goddess smile upon you. It's paragliding time! Ho! Oh! Hi! Yes! Alright, deal's a deal. Give me that paraglider. With this, you now acquired all the spirit orbs from the shrines on this plateau. <laughs> oh, 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 extraordinary. <laughs> that means it is finally time. Link. It is finally time. I know, you just told me. For me to tell you everything. But first. But first. Hmm. Imagine an X on your map. With the four shrines as the endpoints, find the spot where those lines intersect. I shall wait for you there. Do you understand where those where two lines connecting the shrines would cross. Well, um, you know it would really be helpful to getting to that location? A paraglider that you so gleefully ran off with and didn't give me. I, I hate you. You're the worst. This guy is such a liar. Like, he's never gonna give me that paraglider. Just being like strung along, thinking I'm gonna get some sweet, sweet gear. Then never happens. So the connection between these two or these four is somewhere in between. Right about here. Oop. There's a star. That's my guesstimate. Of where it would be. Let's go. Well, it looks like he. <gasps> Gasp! Oh my god. It is. A sword. All the pens. All the pens need to go there. Is he gonna make me go back to the thing and pray? I hope not. Rusty broadsword. This once fearsome sword has been seen or has seen better days. It can do some damage in the right hands, but also break quickly. Uh, okay, so this doesn't seem right. What to drop? I don't want to drop anything. I guess I'll drop this. Cool, I got a 
a rusty broadsword. I did it. Hmm. What is this like ring of things going on over here? Was I supposed to jump in that little, like, fall, like, directly in that area? Oh, there we go. I did it. Yeah, ha ha, you found me. Karaka seed. Bye bye. Bye bye now. Well, that's, that's not what I needed either. Oh. Oh. Obviously, it's the Temple of Time. And it even mentioned how I need four shrines. Yep. Yep. You who have conquered the shrines and claimed their spirit orbs. In exchange for four spirit orbs, I will amplify your being. So tell me, what is it that you desire? Ooh, I get choices? I... I... Hmm... I get stamina. Climb longer. I get heart containers. And live longer. Hmm... This is never a bad choice. Yes. I shall grant the power you seek. Oh yeah, look at that sweet, sweet heart orb. Your life force has been strengthened, increasing your maximum number of hearts by one. And all four hearts. Yes. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. Okay, weird statue Whoa. lady. Why is this dude always yelling at me? And flying in from out of nowhere. The blessing of the goddess has made you that much more resilient, I see. <laughs> here I am. Up, get up here quickly. Urgh. This guy. I see you. <laughs> well done there, young one. <gasps> he speaks. Now then, the time has come to show you who I truly am. I was King Rome Bosphoramus Hyrule. What a name. I was the last leader of Hyrule. A kingdom which no longer exists. Uh, he fancy. The great calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path, lo, a century ago. It was then that my life was taken away from me. And since that time, here I have remained in spirit form. I did not His think it wise to point. overwhelm you while your memory was still fragile. So rather than that, I thought it best to assume a temporary form. Forgive me. I think you are now ready. Ready to hear what happened 100 years ago. To know Calamity Ganon's true form, one must know the story from an age long past. The Demon King was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. But there was also 
a prophecy. The signs of a resurrection of Calamity Ganon are clear, and the power to oppose it lies dormant beneath the ground. We decided to heed the prophecy and began excavating large areas of land. It wasn't long before we discovered several ancient relics made by the hands of our distant ancestors. These relics, the Divine Beasts, were giant machines piloted by warriors. We also found the Guardians, an army of mechanical soldiers who fought autonomously. This coincided with ancient legends oft repeated throughout our land. We also learned of a princess with a sacred power, and her appointed knight chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power of these ancient relics. One hundred years ago, there was a princess set to inherit a sacred power, and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear that we must follow our ancestors' path. We selected four skilled individuals from across Hyrule and tasked them with the duty of piloting the Divine Beasts. With the Princess as their commander, we dubbed these pilots Champions, a name that would solidify their unique bond. The Princess, her appointed knight, and the rest of the Champions were on the brink of sealing away Ganon. But nay. Ganon was cunning, and he responded with a plan beyond our imagining. He appeared from deep below Hyrule Castle, seized control of the Guardians and the Divine Beasts. Us. The champions lost their lives, those residing in the castle as well. The appointed knight gravely wounded and collapsed while defending the princess. And thus, the kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely by Calamity Ganon. However, the princess survived to face Ganon alone. Link, you are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. That princess was my own daughter, my dear Zelda. Oh no. And the courageous knight who protected her right up to the very end. That night was none other than you, Link. You fought valiantly when your fate took an unfortunate turn. And then you were taken to the Shrine of Resurrection. Here you now stand, revitalized 100 years later. The words of guidance you have been hearing since your awakening are from Princess Zelda herself. Even now, as she works to restrain Ganon from within Hyrule Castle, she calls out for your help. However, my daughter's power will soon be exhausted. Once that happens, Ganon will freely regenerate himself, and nothing will stop him from consuming our land. Considering that I could not save my own kingdom, I have no right to ask this of you, Link. I am powerless here. You must save her, my daughter, and do whatever it takes to annihilate Ganon. Somehow, Ganon has maintained control over all four divine beasts, as well as those guardians swarming around Hyrule Castle. I believe it would be quite reckless for you to head directly to the castle at this point. I suggest that you make your way east out to one of the villages in the wilderness. Follow the road out to Kakariko village. There yes. you will find the Elder Impa, 
She will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. The path! Consult the map on your Shiga slate for the precise location of Kakariko Village. Make your way past the twin summits of the dueling peaks. From there, follow the road as it proceeds north. Hmm. Here is the paraglider, just as promised. Yes! <sighs> it actually happened, I got the paraglider. Yes! Press X while you're in the air to use it. That is awesome. <laughs> With that, you should be able to safely fly off the cliffs surrounding this area. And I think that's it. <laughs> I've told you everything I can. Like, you must save Hyro. I'll do it, old man. Seek out Impa. And away we go! Yes! Ah, this is amazing! It's everything I ever thought it would be. Ah, oh, this is so cool! I'm so happy! I can paraglide now. So, stamina seems pretty important because for paragliding too. Hmm. 